Hi, my name is Jim Ciandella with Faltech, and today with the help of the Faltech demonstration and training trailer, we're going to be talking about a six-foot mini self-retracting device and the advantages it has over your typical six-foot shock-absorbing lanyard in terms of calculating your total fall clearance. In other videos posted on Faltech.com, we've demonstrated a drop into a six-foot shock-absorbing lanyard and demonstrated that it needed at least 17 and a half feet of total fall clearance from the anchor point to the ground. Now we're going to do a drop with that six-foot self-retracting device to show you the obvious fall clearance calculation advantages. Let's go ahead and do the drop. So you can see from this drop into this six-foot mini self-retracting device, the obvious advantages it has in terms of total fall clearance compared to your typical six-foot shock-absorbing lanyard which in previous videos we've seen requires a total fall clearance of at least 17 and a half feet. So the way we calculate the total fall clearance for this six foot mini is first we start with the total deceleration distance, which for this particular unit is two and a half feet. Then we take into account the one foot of harness stretch and dorsal D-ring shift, and then a one and a half foot safety factor for a grand total of five feet, which is calculated from the walking working surface down.